Hello, the amazing D365 community. This is Danica Makatangay, your Miss Dynamic Millennial. For today's topic, we are going to talk about one of the most useful and interactive tools that we utilize when working with lots and tons of data to be uploaded, updated, or even to be deleted. And yes, you got it right. We are going to talk about open and Excel templates. Now, you might going to ask me, Danica, open an Excel template. I have been using that a lot already. Whenever I upload, I update records in D365FO. Now, my question is, what if there is no readily available open an Excel template for that form, for that data entity that you wanted to update or you wanted to upload in bulk? Let's take in an example uh, our global address book under organization administration global address book global address book. We wanted or I wanted to update the party contact information for my workers, vendors, or even for my customers. And I need to update that in bulk records. But I wanted to make sure that I am using the same party ID when I do that. Of course, there is data management framework that is available for us to do that and for us to accomplish that. But we have to make sure that we are having the correct party ID record for that vendor or customer as an example. What if we really wanted to make sure that we are having the correct party ID for our records that we are going to update? Now, we have one of the functions here in D365 called Excel Workbook Designer. Let Help me navigate modules, common, Office Integration, Excel Workbook Designer. Now, if you were going to notice, this are the bunch of list of data entities available in D365. And uh, with our scenario earlier, I wanted to bulk upload party contact information for me to be able to update or add contact information for my vendors, customers, employees, and making sure that I am doing that on the correct party ID number for them. Now, on the filter pane, I am going to look for the party, look for that data entity. One thing to have in mind is you have to know what the data entity is for us to be able to arrive on the correct workbook designer. So I know that the party contact V3 is the correct one. So I, on the right pane, I am going to select all the fields available just to be sure that I am getting all the data all the information that I wanted for that record. Now, uh, you just need to click this for you to be able to select all or to move that onto the selected fields. And click Create Workbook, Download. And once that file has been downloaded, we can open that. That is readily available. And we can use that similarly with the open in Excel that is readily available in any forms. That easy D365 amazing community and how to use or to create a new workbook designer for us to accomplish or upload, modify records that we wanted in D365 and making sure that we are not creating a new one whenever we just wanted to upload it. And that is all the amazing D365 community for this topic of the day. I hope it has been a helpful thing for everyone here listening today. Thank you very much. God bless us all.